Now that we have all our weapons on the table, this house means officially in order. First item of business, the milk is missing. Oh, oh, milk. Wow. Mm -hmm. Who wow. finished the milk? I say we launch a full-scale investigation right now. Yeah. Immediately. Immediately. Let's detectivate it. How did I move in to this house with these people? I don't really remember very much about that time in my life, but uh, I think it had something to do with the fact that there are detectives and I'm a detective. There's uh, three other roommates here. Uh, one's a fucking Soviet whore egg, if that's what, you know, if you want a nice word for her. Detective house, detective house, detective house. How did I move into this house? Male older bride. Three little words, one big commitment. I'm just, I don't know what to do. I mean, I need to keep the marriage together, but. <sighs> Carol. What can I say about Carol? He man with woman name, but then. Uh... Everything else about them is woman, too. <laughs> you know what I mean? Nicorette, you're smoking. I thought you quit. I did. These are light cigarettes. You no, know I'd prefer if you didn't smoke. Well, I prefer if you want to get it. Oh, Carol, here we go again. Oh. Carol! But she drives me crazy. She's constantly at my throat. Just bitch, bitch, bitch. All the time. I became a detective because I I wanted to figure things out. I wanted to figure out, I guess, just life. I pretty much have solved all mystery in Russia, so I guess I needed a little more of a challenge come to the United States, you know? I investigate things almost daily. The way her eyes get when they gloss over, they're just... So beautiful, I would follow Lindsay to the ends of the earth. Subject's luscious lips seem to be consuming wine, not milk. We should proceed elsewhere. Surveillance isn't working. Oh shit, I think I might be in over my head. Detective House! That Mac McGill character, he creeps me out too. He's always lurking around, stalking things. <gasps> always something. What is happening? <sighs> Somebody drank all my vodka. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. No. <laughs> Actually, I think it was just me. <laughs> the idiot. I mean, I think Lindsay drinks because she's in pain. Like, if you'd seen the footage you know, I've seen of her, it just. Yeah, she has some serious issues. She's always fucking drunk. She has her head in the toilet every night. She has seen more inside the toilet than. Mr. Clean, you know? I'm worried about Lindsay, too. I'm beginning not to trust her anymore. I mean, I know we had all those years together before in the past and solving crimes together, but now I just think she's about to bring the whole house down. And I'm a Russian, so if she's alcoholic, I mean it. You're such a good listener. You're the best, Lindsay. Reminds me of the old days. I, I've 
brush on Mac. I know I'm supposed to keep everything closed off, and but he's just so dreamy. He's just so manly. And uh, with Nicorette, it's always been we take care of each other, but with Mac, it's special. That print looks like my mail order wife. It's her white Russians again. <sighs> Nicorette. The fingerprint evidence is in, and it appears that you are the one who's stolen the milk. I bet for the white Russians. Well, then you'd be wrong, because in Russia, we simply call it white. Uh, one's a fucking Soviet whore bag, if that's what, you know, if you want a nice word for her. Detective House! They don't think I see what's going on, but I do. <laughs> it's crazy town. You know one thing? I don't trust that dog. If you ask me, I think they are in over their heads. <laughs>